this tutorial, we'll be covering how to copy a vocabulary file in the Words for Life on your iPad. Your resource will be in the Words for Life Google Classroom under Classwork. You look down in Materials, and there's a programming quick reference guide both in English and in Spanish. I'm going to open up English one, and we'll be covering this material right here copying a default vocabulary so that it can be modified. Let's take a look at our iPad. So sometimes we need to uh, make modifications to the vocabulary, um, like personalize it, put it, add in students' names. Maybe we wanna limit some of the vocabulary our students have available. For example, when we're doing a structured activity like teaching colors, um, so there's ways um, that you can hide icons, that you can add icons, that you can edit. Um, but in order to do that, you have to first be able to copy uh, one of the default vocabularies. So um, I'm sure if you've played around with your Words for Life, you may have noticed that under Menu, over in that top right corner, if you go to Edit Page, you get a message that says, this is an original vocabulary file that cannot be modified. A copy must be made in order to edit. So that's what we're going to do. So if you go to that top left where it says vocab and choose a new vocabulary, you can see that um, the first five vocabularies are locked but that's one of the ones that we want to copy so that we can have that access to those vocabulary words before we start editing. So I'm gonna go over to that right hand corner on the blue ribbon and touch menu. And I'm gonna come down and do copy a vocabulary. Now you'll notice that right above it, it says create a new vocabulary. This is if you wanna build a vocabulary from scratch. And so if I did create, then it's gonna show me an empty shell, um, just empty squares with no icons, no text. And we don't want to build the vocabulary from scratch. We want to take the existing vocabulary and modify it. So we're going to copy a vocabulary. It's going to ask us which one would you like to copy? And we're going to pick Lamp Words for Life Full. And then you're going to title it. So we're going to title um, this one copy and we're gonna hit save. If you're making this for a certain student, you might wanna use their name, or if you're making it for a certain activity, like teaching colors or going outside, you can title it those kinds of things. You can add a description if you want to, but you don't have to. And so I have a lot of copied vocabularies, but you'll notice that it'll be the very last one, and that's the one we're gonna select so that we can go in and modify it later. But now we're in this one, uh, in the copied version, it can be changed, modified, edited, and that's how you copy a vocabulary. Thanks for joining me.